how much is owed to the bank and by whom, one, and two, was there any consideration, even under the arbitration of uh, pursuing the former owners of UHS and or BHBL uh, for that money? If it's, if it's the government that owes it, uh, why, why are they exempt? Well, I think that's a good point. The first question is that the amount that is going to my client is over $50 million in interest continuing to accrue. The government has chosen not to pay anything and therefore interest continues to accrue. That's the first point. The second point is, which you raise, is the question of why didn't government go after other persons to recover whatever they are liable for. I think that's a question that ought to be put to the government. The government chose not to participate in the arbitration, and therefore those are issues which could have been raised and should have been raised there, but they didn't. Once again, mm -hmm. it seems to me that the government's strategy is we will not participate in an arbitration, and then we will try to raise the arguments in the courts in Belize, which we should have raised in the arbitration. And I mean, the law is very much against them on 